All right, so I guess I got to address this once again. I no longer play high stakes online. And I no longer play mid stakes online. I play low stakes. And it's not even to make money because I no longer make money playing online games. This is why I go to the casino. I just don't trust it. I don't know how many times I got to say it or show it or prove it. But that's the whole point of this channel. Now, apparently, according to this guy, which I will show in a few moments, I'm broke or this and that. Um, it's funny because it's always the broke people love bringing up that other people are broke when that's not even the case. They can't even count that high. Um, I was doing, before I even got kicked off of ACR, I was actually playing a lot of the celebrity games on there. Um, buying in for a few thousand and so forth and so on. And this is just a, a few little pictures um, of me. Well, I've started to come down in stakes over the years because, again, just didn't trust it. So, yes, I, now I do play these small games just to show people what's going on. But in real life, you probably can't count that high. So let me go ahead and show you what I'm talking about here. So this is what I'm talking about. So let's read it together. It says, bro. Number one, I'm not your bro, um, faggot. And it says, you're playing a $17 pot. Yes, I am playing a $17 pot. Don't know which video he's talking about, but most likely that's true. Um, it says, nobody is um, wasting their time cheating on the broke boy tables. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Um, I don't like to do this, but I will do this at this point. And I'm sorry if I offend anyone or come off wrong. But eventually, these people do have to learn. And they definitely have to learn to stay in their place. Now, again, I'm pretty sure you can't count that high. I'm pretty sure you work at a, a, a dead-end job. Me, I don't. I get to travel. I get to live. I get to enjoy life. And not really have too many worries. You, on the other hand... Probably live at home with mommy and daddy. Probably work a dead end job. And probably getting cheated on by a girl that doesn't even like you. But let's go ahead and continue. Um, these are the same people you do not want to listen to. Um, there's plenty of examples out there. Um, and I've showed plenty of examples. And you guys can definitely go search plenty of these examples on your own. But again, I'll say it again, there's been plenty of hacker groups um, that have stolen a penny. Yes, a penny from transactions, millions of transactions over a long period of time. And what did those pennies add up to? Billions. Now, more geared towards poker. Why do they have bots then? Why are bots sitting at smaller tables? And playing. Because again. All of it adds up. And that's why you're probably broke. Because you don't understand. Money. You just don't understand. Pennies add up. Dollars add up. Change add up. And if they're going to. If there's a way to get it. They will get it. So. You guys can continue to trust online poker as you, as you please, and I'll continue not to lo no longer trust it. Why? Too much evidence out there. Too many different stories. Too many different events. And stop trying to count people pockets when you don't have pockets to count on your own.